That's what we're moving on to here. Is that gonna fit? I don't think that's gonna fit. Okay, starting off we're in uh, Dreamland. Run back to Sheik. Not trying the ZSS this time like I saw him do last time. Yeah. Going right to. Kind of going uh, right a Sheik. bit out of his usual range to try and have a counter pick for. I think he just needs to get used to the matchup. I don't think his character is just like. Gotta get used to fighting Peach. And like, Peach is a weird matchup. I fought a Peach earlier and it's like, it's strange to fight this character. Like, a lot of Peach approaches are with that float, right? Yeah. Oh, okay, oh, we I got a problem we have going a controller on here. Malfunction. Oh, there we go. Let's just kinda... Okay, okay, we're going back. We're gonna continue, okay. Into forward air, into forward air, into forward air, into forward air. Those Tinder combos. <laughs> Good old cheek. Strike off to a good start here, 47%. Uh, you grab here. Peach has a surprisingly large amount of tools that kill pretty early, actually. Yeah. Very harsh. Some uh, large damage output, too. Peach is also very good at edge guarding, but I think with Sheik, like, Sheik is almost impossible to edge guard anyway, so yeah. that's not a part of the matchup. I think it's really going to go into it. Some random grenades coming out of Strike right now. I don't think those are probably button errors. He's not eating too hard of a punish for them. He's just, he's just capping with needles right now, which is probably a good idea, I think. Yeah, Not I really mean, capping, but using a lot of Peach doesn't have, like, a whole ton of options to get in there. Yeah. So if you're throwing needles at her, she casts kind of come right at you and not much else to do. Yeah, if you force her to approach, yeah, I think that's a, that's a good idea. Oh, go. Always going to hit that fair. It almost killed it, like, 70%. Yeah, that fair is ridiculous. But I think, like, sometimes it doesn't kill because I think with Peach sometimes... Forward air is also like a damaging move, and it's also a kill move, so like by the time you need to kill with it, it's stale. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. But I think it'll certainly kill, yeah. Oh, there you go. Okay. <laughs> Center stage, 120% dead. Yeah. Bambi off to uh, lead again. Only 83%. She's going to live for a little bit longer, too. It's Sheik. Well, she Sheik took the early lead uh, by quite well, a lot. Well, that was percent. a stitch. Oh, wow. 68%. Holy Jesus. This is not looking good for Strike right now. That both these characters is so hard to edge guard. Up tilt. I think they're kind of just playing it safe and just letting each other recover for the most part. Yeah. I don't think like he wants to get in a position where he's going to accidentally get hit by up being up to like, tech the stage. Yeah. Just like, well, she could give a little edge guard anyway. Got the upper. I don't think it's going to kill. No, one more will. No, yeah, usually maybe around 120. Strong dash attack from Peach. Good man, because this forward air is coming close. Yeah. One hit, one solid hit. And oh, okay, that's gonna oh, take the stock. Very, very good from Strike, because now he can read easy for a little bit. No rage on Peach. He should live like, even a good strong hit if he gets it. Just needs a suicide move, kill Peach first. Yeah. All is good. Sheik's side, I don't think she has one of those. That's uh, the one thing she doesn't have. <laughs> yeah, they decided that maybe she shouldn't get one of those as well. Those forward air combos, 17%. It's not another realm possibility, it's chic, but you gotta be very careful at this point. Good combos, 37%. He's climbing back here. Good grab. They nice shine, but he's gotta be careful not to eat one of these forward airs. Yeah, that's the big thing right now. Any strong hit from Peach, yeah. you could die. He, Sheik's coming close, though. Yeah, 70%. This is anyone's game all of a sudden. Beatles. Definitely just trying to play it safe at this point. Yeah, don't want to get it. Uh, I do think too major here. It looked like Strike was doing better when he was like really pressuring Peach. So like, I think it, it's like, I don't know, kind of a mix between like capping with needles and like once you get in, stay in. Yeah. Oh, slaps. Anything will kill at this point from Peach. And very little will kill at this point for Sheik. Yes. Oh. That's coming close though. Up air might kill another one. He's got lots of rage if he gets it. 
Ah, uh, this is true, yeah. Okay, here we go. No follow up. No. Didn't think so. I will jump out oh, of that. Oh, random. Okay, that. No. Order. She can make it back. Oh, here we go. Big comeback. Oh! Oh! oh. Just barely so avoiding the up smash. Oh! And the dash attack's and gonna there take you it. Go. That'll do it. A hey, dash attack is so strong. Well, it's impressive that he managed to live to 163%. Yeah, yeah, he made a big comeback there. That was anyone's game right at the end there. Yeah. Big comeback to the strike. Let's see if he can carry that over for game two. It's gonna update the. There one. Up. For some reason I was thinking that was already game two, but absolutely not. That was game one. Maybe because they stopped like mid match, right? So it's like maybe it took a little longer. Yeah, it could be. Not sure. It's gonna go to Alfino. Interesting pick. I'm not sure if Sheik is really well. Kind of benefits from the stage a little bit. What's that? I'm not sure if Sheik is benefits from the stage too much. Maybe a little bit. Uh, if you can get him during the uh, stage transformation, you can do the oh. down throw to uh, up air and catch him pretty oh, early. Oh, and also he might be doing one to like carry uh, them like off the stage, like on the walkoffs too. I'm, I'm wondering. Like, yeah, the forward air string can do that for yeah. sure. Like if he gets like down throw or no forward throw and uh, boxing fish, that may kill if it's like right by the walk off. Yeah, that oh, could yeah. be what he's going for. They're just kind of trading right now. Another grab, no follow ups. Just getting the percentage though. Over there. Over there. Kind of impressive to watch. You, you see Sheik land like, you know, 10, 15 hits. And you're like, okay, well, he must be dead soon. And then you look, his opponent's only taking like 50%. And you're like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing of Sheik. You get hit a bunch of times, it's only like 4% each time. Oh, that might kill. Yeah, yeah, that's going to take it. Yeah. That's probably exactly why I picked the stage. Yeah, you get one good grab and your punch is dead. I'm pretty sure they banned this on Anthers. Probably because, like, of that. Uh, yeah, we're gonna be updating for the next tournament the uh, stage list. We're gonna be taking away Delfino Plaza, Castle Siege. Oh, really? And, uh. What was the other one we wanted to get rid of? Halberd or? Halberd, yeah. That's oh, one. yeah. And Castle Halberd. Siege, I don't know. That one's that, that's just like. Castle Siege is max, maximum drink. It's, 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 it's a jank stage, pretty much, yeah. Like, I had a point today that, like, I guess I never really, like, wasn't familiar with playing on it before. Yeah. And the stage transformation. When it transforms to like the the walk off or like the really big yeah. tilting stage to something oh, else. Oh, that's gonna be it. And that'll do it. Yeah, like see, like I said, the top of the stage too. You get them 54 percent. Yeah, right hit. in the transition. Right in the platform. You gotta be careful not to get grabbed there, especially by Sheik. It's gonna be one one. We're gonna go to game three here. Yeah, like not knowing uh, how the transformation works with Castle Siege. Sometimes someone's like grabbing onto the edge. And when you're aware of the transformations coming, you start for, like charging a forward smash, and suddenly it starts transforming, and they get put right in front of you in a forward smash and die. Or uh, if you're standing on the level and it transitions to one of the ones without uh, floors on the side, yeah. sometimes it'll just drag you right down and you're dead. Uh, yeah. That's pretty easy to avoid, but if you don't know about it... Also, you... if you have like bad recovery and like you're in the air and it transitions, sometimes that can lead death for you too. Because like, you could be way far away and your recovery is not going to make it over. Yeah, can it, it like raises the floor to basically where your characters are too. So sometimes yeah. you just get like spiked against the ground for no reason. You're yeah. Like, oh, okay. Hey, you went to the match uh, right here. Striking a 33 percent right now. Why wow, that cruise? Pretty neutral. Forward airs. I think this is pretty neutral. Uh, pick right here. What I'm wondering is he might like the needles might get caught on one of the tilts. This is like Bambi's counter pick, right? So that might be what he's going for. Well, it seems that uh, the really strike has definitely made the needed adjustments after game one. Yes, absolutely. 65% to 4% right now. He's just he's running in there and just throwing up his shield, eating the attacks, and then doing what he needs to do, which is, is usually some kind of throw string into forward hairs. Yeah, he really seems to have adjusted. Uh, right, like He kept going right after that comeback he almost had in game one. Yeah. He's just continuing that uh, that momentum. Oh, got that up smash. That's not going to kill quite kill. Yeah. Oh, good forward air. Nice. He's, 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 oh, oh, okay, that's going to take chased it. chased Sheik off the stage and killed her. Drop off forward air. It's so strong. That killed like 66%.
Yeah. That's what you have to be careful of. Like, yeah. I've played Batman before, and he does. Like, that's that's how he edge guards. So you have to be like. Like, I've been hit by it too. I play Fox, so it's really easy to edge guard me, so. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> In the downers. Stress how I get this kill, I think, before it gets too much oh, percent. Lands on the stage. I don't think he wants to play from behind too much. He needs a. Oh, okay. I think he was fishing for an up smash a bit there. He goes. He's literally looking for this kill. Oh, down smash. Well, even just, with the uh, the needed adjustments, that uh, early death seems to have really uh, not looking so good for our hero. No, there he goes. He got the stock. It's possible. He's gonna need uh, another start, like at the beginning of this map. Absolutely. Oh, I gotta get 50, that quick. 60 60. percent to nothing. Whoa, up smash. That's not gonna quite take it. That's. Just, Ooh, oh, back here, not gonna not kill. And oh. oh, misses the smash. percent okay. Here we go. I was gonna say he should have went for a bouncing fish there, but I don't know, maybe it's too risky at this point. Dash it, dash attack will kill at this point. I uh, think. Yeah, it's pretty close. Four there. Back air, not gonna. Oh, okay, oh, no, he's gonna yeah, take it. Go. He's done. That's gonna be it. Bambi double eliminate strike. That's it. Strike is out. 